Moving my digital footprint from the internet so Amy Farrah Fowler can't find me and compel me to meet her mother. Oh, you're going off the grid. Exactly. The old Unabomber approach. Kudos. <laughs> Thank you. I've also sent Amy a relationship termination notice and changed my cell phone number and email address. What if she just comes over? She'll get lost. We no longer live at 2311 Los Robles. We now live at 311 Los Robles. <laughs> you changed the address on the building? What about mail? Yeah, but no worries. I explained my predicament to our letter carrier. He was sympathetic. His exact words were, Got your back, Jack. Bitches be crazy. <laughs> here before. The only flaw in an otherwise perfect plan. Now get my back, Jack. What do you want to do? Tell her I'm not here. Okay, where are you? I don't know. You'll have to devise a scenario that plausibly explains my absence, keeping in mind that the key to a good lie lies in the details. Hi, Amy. Sheldon's not here. All right. Way to go on the details. I see. Proceed on A. Those are the stars that are nearest to me. Tra la la and fiddle dee dee. Oh dear. They really do be crazy. <laughs> Easy Aquarius B. Easy Aquarius C. Excuse me, madam. Sheldon? Rats. I believe a misunderstanding may have occurred when I asked you to meet my mother. No misunderstanding. I've learned what that request actually means, and I don't want to be joined to another object by an inclined plane wrapped helically around an axis. In what way are you screwed? All I want to do is present you as my boyfriend to my mother so she'll be satisfied that I'm in a relationship. So we'd be perpetrating a ruse? Precisely. And you haven't fallen hopelessly in love with me? Don't be absurd. I find the notion of romantic love to be an unnecessary cultural construct that adds no value to human relationships. I mean, Farrah Fowler, that's the most pragmatic thing anyone has ever said to me. I trust this clarification allows us to return to boy slash friend slash girl slash friend status? Of course. Would you like to join me for Chinese food? Sheldon, please, you're suffocating me. My apologies.